Um, so you're at the trophy. I, mean, I don't know when. <laughs> a little smile in face. Um, disappointed with the exit, the manner of it, or no? I just I thought we just lacked a little bit of quality in the final third. Lost the game of football. Mm. Fair play to them. They banked up really well, and it was on the break. So mm. I wish them all the best in the next round. Mm. <laughs> you did have <laughs> starting from the beginning. I think you had a couple of people rolling up late as well. You, you had changes. You had a couple of people missing. I mean, it wasn't conducive to a, a FA Trophy tie, probably. No, no. I mean, a few of the players got stuck on the A1. There was a terrible smash on there. Mm. Uh, these, these things you, know, you can't legislate for. Mm. So, uh, now what we had, we, we went with. Mm. So, uh, those that were fit and able, and some weren't even fit and able to stay. But no, it's, mm. they, uh, they give as good as what they mm. can get. It just wasn't good enough on the day today. We are talking about a team from a division above you as well. It shouldn't be forgotten, should it? Oh, no, you know, no, that, no. Uh, it was, uh, I'm not sure about the sending off. I don't, I don't know what, really what happened. I think they're complaining about the melee before, but it's, it's uh, one of those things. And, and they managed the game quite well, you know, especially with the 10 men. They banked up on us and we didn't have enough, like I said before, we didn't really have enough quality in the final third today to break down. Because unusually you do make a lot of good opportunities, but there weren't really a couple of them in the first yeah. half. And well, I thought we would look better with 10, 10 versus ten on the pitch, or eleven versus eleven on the pitch, yeah. because we had, you know, we got into good spaces and they had a couple of chances. Uh, Alfie had one down down there, but then when um, the sending off happened, then then the spaces they mm. they defended quite. I guess well. they managed that well. Yeah, they didn't did they? very yeah. well. Yeah, and the penalty. Oh no, penalty! Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely penalty. Yeah, mm. yeah. But it, I mean, Smudge's first game, and we're so glad to have him back. I thought he was very good today. He mm. just got caught on the wrong side, and had a little nibble. But a young lady knows that. Mm. I mean, it's not the FA Cup; it's the FA Trophy. Let's be fair about it. And you've got a massive game next week. Are you hugely disappointed at how, what's transpired in the end? No. Delight. No, that's not disrespect <laughs> yeah. to the no, no, trophy, no, is it? No, it's, no. There's things to it's, be done. It was about. Us trying to get through, uh, trying to win the tie first and foremost, but coming out with no injuries. And uh, Sam Kelly felt his uh, calf, which was a blow. Uh, the good thing is, is uh, Smudge has come through 90 minutes, which we're doing the world of good going forward. Um, and we've got a couple of uh, Jordan, Jordan Richards has got a dodgy one, so we've got man. This is what we are, aren't we? We could only put three on the bench, and, and that's, this is it. I hope he didn't look like he ended it. Particularly healthy. No, he's rolled his ankle, so it's another one going to see Carol this week. So uh, we we'll, we we'll just have to turn up in training this week and have a count up. That's, that's all we can do. But um, what what will happen on Saturday is that whatever team goes out there won't let the town down to the, the pump for it. I guess when you you're approaching the last few minutes of this game, it's one nil. Thoughts must start moving. Towards yeah. York, even though they probably were. On well, the, the last thing you anyway. wanted was a replay. That's, That's the, the next thing. question. That yeah, Tuesday they, would have been awful. That would have, that would have killed us because yeah. we ain't got a team, we ain't got a squad anyway at the moment. Mm -hmm. So ha having another game on top and playing on our pitch as well, yeah. it was uh, it could have been a recipe for disaster. So uh, no, I'm, I'm obviously not happy to be at the, the trophy because it's something that we wanted to do, but um, it's it's about protecting these boys and. Uh, to come out with, we probably got a couple of injuries again out of the game, mm. uh, so it hasn't really gone. Been a, a fantastic day for Kingsley today. Just uh, going back to the, the the personnel, Chris Smith. I mean, you've missed him for what, three months now, and he was really getting into his stride, wasn't he? Yeah. Uh, before he got the injury, he sort of looked like he just straight straight back in. Yeah. To, I mean, to do 90 minutes straight off the mm. bat was. A, Unbelievable achievement for him. He's, he's, uh, and just speaking him in there, he's, he said no. He said it felt fine, um, but uh, that would do him the world of good. Was that a risk? Yes. Playing him? Yeah. We ain't got no one else. No. We ain't got no one else. We would have had to put a massive square peg in a round hole, and that's. But that's what we would have had to do. So for him to play 90 minutes and come through and help the team was was tremendous for us. Was Rory just a one game one today, or will he be okay? Well, Rory Rory still feels his uh, calf. Mm -hmm. So as, again, we've got to manage in this week. So I think Carol's going to have a very busy week mm -hmm. in front of her, and uh, we just have to see who's available for us on, on Saturday uh, when we play. Looking ahead to next Saturday, how how big a game is that in your eyes? 
Well, it's, it's not the be all and end all of the, of the league. We're, we're, we're only, well, I think we've still got 19 games to play or something like that, 18 games to play. So, you know, whoever wins the game or if it's a draw, we've still got so many points to play for. So it's not the be all and end all, but uh, it's a big game because it's first versus second, you know, and so um, it's going to be a great atmosphere. Uh, they're bringing down a few and I hope that our crowd turn up. I'm sure they will and get behind the boys. And it's the games you want to be in. This is why we're in this league. It's, it's, it's a great game for us to play. So, but it ain't the be all and end all of, of, of the league, that's for sure. Are you excited by it though? Yeah, look, really looking forward to it. It's, it's going to be a really good challenge because they're a good side. Really good side, full time side they should be, shouldn't they? So, uh, and then we've we just got to go out there and give up or everything. And I'm sure these boys, will, whatever, whatever 11 we put out there, they will give everything for the shirt. And do you look at it, no pressure on you guys whatsoever going into the game? No, there isn't. There, I don't think there is. There's no pressure on us all, all, all season because uh, we've just come up and we're fighting way above our, our weight, like I've always said. But the good thing about this bunch is they will, they will turn up next week. They really will turn up. And the fact that you have got some rest in... Obviously, Jordan Richards, who was doubtful, and Rory, obviously, who, who's carrying a niggle. Does that help? That's obviously helped a little bit, although you've picked up more injuries today, haven't you? Yeah, so. we've picked up another uh, couple today, but the likes of Gashi's had a rest. He's, he's, I mean, he turned up late anyway, so he's stuck on the motorway. And then we've had, we've had we give Mazza, uh, yeah, he had an hour. So we've had to rotate a little bit in there, which, which will help him for next week. Uh, but now we're just trying to utilise the squad as much as we can. I mean, it's it's, it's, it's not pretty at times, but that's, this is what we're down to. I mean, in your eyes, is the result important next week? I mean, you don't obviously you don't want to lose, but you've said it's not the be all and end all. But is it is it important in terms of, of where you're going to finish? No, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think as long as we're competitive and we really get at them and give them a good game, uh, and I think it'd be two sides because they're a very good side. It'd be two sides really going hammer and top it. Looking forward to it because it's, it's a proper game. It really is. And, but we've got many more big games to come after that one. So it's not the be all and end all for the league. I mean, you lost 3 0 down there, but they weren't three goals better than yourselves, were they? No, I think I said on the day that it, uh, in both boxes we were poor and they were better than us in both boxes. But between both boxes, I thought we played really well. I really did. I thought we handled the ball really well, but they were better than us in both boxes. As a team, it does look like you learn from those setbacks Geisley you learn quickly really isn't that? Yeah. and then York when well, that's the last time you lost the league that seems quite yeah, ridiculous it does but do yeah. you think you, your players learn that there's a level yeah I think so I, I, they play with no fear they yeah. really don't I, I mean we, we, we're respectful of who we play you know and, and we look at them and we give them the respect they deserve but once we play we play and uh, as long as we can handle the ball and play without any fear then we'll, we'll be alright we're, we're a good side we are you mentioned Adam Marriott there, inevitable, there'll be speculation about him, and there has been. Yeah. Um, no, I, don't, do I, I believe there ain't been a phone call for yeah. him. Uh, and that's, you know, that's, we can just carry on with that and see what happens. But um, hopefully he'll stay with us. But uh, um, it has to be the right thing for, Mar- for Maz and the right thing for the football club. I mean, it wouldn't be a good thing if he if he wasn't here soon. For no, your intentions. Would but the, the thing is, what I've always said at this football club is that we won't. It's it's all about giving them a platform to get back into the league, and the, the, I'm sure the football club wouldn't stand in the way if it's, it's if it's both good for both parties. How would you feel about that? Oh, I'd be gutted. I'd be gutted. But we 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 got a. Uh, he's, he's enjoying his football, and the players enjoy having him around. And he's, he's, he's a terrific player, really. He's a terrific player. But I'll be delighted for him as well because uh, if he does move on and then gets back into the league, then we've done our job and he's done his job. Mm. Do you think he's good enough to play in league football full time? Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. He's uh, he's a very clever player, very mm. clever, especially around that 18 yard box. Mm. It's not just scoring goals either, it's, it's something out, he does out of the area, it's ridiculous. Yeah, no, his touch is good, his link-up play is very, very good, and he brings other people into the game, and he's, uh, he's, he's been superb for us in the two years he's been here. I'm not trying to make you put advert in the <laughs> no, 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 not for sale. <laughs> okay. Are, 